Hello guys, hello guys, hello guys. Welcome to another one of my Case Clicker campaign videos. I am playing the game through from the very start to the very end. In this video, I'm going to be grinding 50 Bravo cases and then I am going to open them and hopefully jump away from the legendary eagle um, bum, ba -da -dum, bum, bum, account level, I guess it's called. I'm not sure what it's called, but that is what we are moving away from in this video here. So I'm just uh, doing the ninja thing a bit here as uh, as fast as I can because I want 50 Bravo cases and I get about one every every four case searches here. Um, so it is going to take some time. Uh, I don't really know how long. I haven't actually looked at the time of it uh, and I have done this quite a few times so I guess I should but um, I haven't looked into the amount of time I spend farming 50 Bravo cases by tapping, but yeah, I guess I should look into that really before making the next video. So, but that is, um, that's what's going to happen in this video. Clicking, clicking, clicking for 50 cases, then I am, not 50 cases, 50 Bravo cases, because I have loads of cases, I just don't want to open the junk ones. Um, and once I have done that, I should finally be able to grab the next upgrade and move away from here. Uh, and what's so good about that? Well, we get to open even more cases, that's a good part. Um, no, we move uh, closer, step by step, towards the global elite, hopefully landing in some nice items in the process. Did get the minimal wear uh, fire serpent in the last 50 cases. Um, got a few pinks in the 70 before that uh, so slowly adding account value slowly moving towards the end game um, so yeah I like that I really do like that and a side note if you kind of haven't watched episode 10 <laughs> you don't need to uh, I'm uh, clicking for and opening 70 Bravo cases without really getting anything interesting but um, I fiddled with my background music in there, so it is so loud that you can barely hear what I am saying in it. So that is worth mentioning before, uh, yeah, just in case you are checking out these videos in the opposite order of uh, the actual game progression. But so my fingers are titty tired. Um, I'm actually recording this episode right after the previous one and um, that is because I have like 12 hours at the university Monday which is actually now because it's like 1 a.m. Um, but I did want to be able to share something with you anyway so I am letting this video cook overnight and then once I have a break at the university I will add the description for it and, uh, and share it so there is a bit of a smaller gap between the videos I add in. But I do need to grab the 50 cases first and that is going to take some time. I did mention in the last video how I get the fast case searches. But considering that it is something I get questions for every once in a while, I just want to quickly show the difference between the normal and this way of getting the cases in the settings you have something called gameplay options and here you have main screen animations and case draw animations and the main screen animations are the cases falling in the background and this here is the case draw animation it looks cool it adds a nice uh, depth layer to the game, I think, but uh, if you need to do this 1500 times, it is more fun not having them. So removing those two checkboxes is going to allow you to search for cases faster, and uh, yeah, I like that. I really do like that. Probably one of the best features in the entire game, I think. Uh, I think I read about the most recent update that you guys have on Android and iOS players like myself don't, is that there was a speed improvement for the case opening. If that is a case, <laughs> the case, clicker, 
then that would be super amazing because it could really use a small nudge in the right direction. Wow, almost halfway there already. That's nice. Hope I don't run into like a dead streak like I did in the previous video. I don't know how many breakout cases in a row I got while needing just one Bravo case. That was super annoying. Well, not super annoying, but a little annoying. Uh, needing one and it was just breakout, breakout, breakout. But I did ask for it, so uh, that was on me really. Looking around for my coffee. Uh, a bit annoying to miss your coffee when you're super thirsty and it's past 1 a.m. But um, I'm not sure. Perhaps it's on the floor. Because I did push my computer further away from me in order to be able to get the iPad in the webcam feed. So yeah, that would be funny. Then I need to then I know what I should be doing once I'm done recording this, then I can uh, clean the floor. No, I'm just kidding. I probably had it all. Like Pokemon, just coffee. Gotta drink it all. So, definitely on the right side of being halfway now. I do like knowing, uh, like when I'm missing 10 or 15, so that I can just count it out. Uh, and that is because I don't want to have too many. Then I will uh, blow my system. Suddenly I will be having one case too much opened and everything will be out of order. Yeah, I know it's crazy, but that's how it is. It is easier to manage, thing, manage things when uh, the numbers aren't way odd. For me anyway. I guess it's a personality thing. So, 16 left. I should be double tapping this. Should be trying. One. Not sure if it's faster. Two. Three. Four. Come on, five, yeah, now we're talking. Okay, I don't hit the buttons as precisely. Six, so ten left. I remember having ten left in the last video, that was a bummer, like major. It does feel faster. Which is really frustrating when I don't hit the button. So one. I don't think the iPad can handle this many pressures really. I think that's what's bugging it. Two. Three. I need to go one hand. Four. Nice. I'll just keep coming. Keep coming, he said. Come on. Five. Six, yeah. Seven. Eight, right on. Nine, now we're talking, this is crazy. Come on. Lucky number ten. He's coming right now. So, 50 Bravo cases. Let us get something crazy this time. Did get the fire serpent last time, that was really cool. It was minimal wear. Not stat track. Um, I was thinking about buying the stat track guarantee throughout the video, but considering how little coin we earn right now, um, I figured it would be better to save it for a little later when we get more per tap and then build up a bit of a more nasty. Uh, income, but yeah, we're probably just going to be doing uh, some uh, gods and monsters and cobblestone collections before that. Oh, goody. I do 
Okay, I was just about to say that I already had a plan about it, but I'm thinking about whether or not I want to complete all collections uh, in this series, as in all stickers, all autographs, all of it. Um, part of me really thinks it would be cool. At the same time, I'm not really sure how interesting it is. But uh, I'm a bit geeky, so I may just do it. And I'm really crazy geeky, so I probably will, but um, yeah. it's a time thing again, really. If nobody gives a beep, uh, it's not that good an idea to do it. Yeah, I'm starting to mumble because it's way too late. Way too late. And that is, of course, because I need to get up in like, I don't know, four and a half hours or something. Oh goody. Bravo, bravo. I am thinking about doing a few Hearthstone videos tomorrow depending on how things look when I get home, how much homework I have. Because I will get late home, obviously, like eight in the evening or something like that. But perhaps I won't have um, a lot of homework. Then I could find the time to do a little crazy something. Just grind a few ranks. Uh, I think I'm like rank 18 or 19 after the month reset. So not that impressive. But I think the game that I feel the need to play the most is um, is Craft the World, where I'm making a series as well, similar to this, playing every second of the game. And I really enjoy doing that. Um, but the, I mean, those videos also end up being like one hour each. Uh, I do feel that is the minimum I want to play the game in order to, to get a good walkthrough of, of a period of it. But um, So I, I hope to do that tomorrow, that or Hearthstone. Um, in addition to a jackpot video or two, of course. But I need luck and time. And I really want both. It's not that I'm greedy, I just want to be lucky and have a lot of time. How much more can... I mean, isn't that okay? I think it is. Yay, Nova Tempest. Woohoo! So almost halfway through these, and that's okay. Last time we didn't get anything until the very end, so um, I'm not afraid. I'm not worried. I'm just expecting that all good comes to those who wait, and I wait. I will get all the good. If not, I just haven't waited long enough. I mean, that has to be what it means, right? Bone pile. That's not good. That's not good. That's the rush reward. So give me more. Yeah, that was what I got. I got more. If you do the same thing, expect to get the same result. Yeah, that's wisdom for you. Move along. I click the same button. I want the same knife. <laughs> yeah. I'm even too tired to hold the pen spinning pen. That's really a bummer. But I also miss having the background music. So come on now, bravo. You can start filling in pinks and reds now. That's okay. Even a koi, I could accept the koi. Just getting a red, you know. Not just any red. A colored red. Ooh, stop. Ah. Deceleration for the win. What's it gonna be? 
a wave spray yummy just saw that I have 1284 breakout cases that's pretty silly <laughs> note the sell value on them six cents yeah and I don't think you can batch sell them I think you need to do it individually so let's just uh, be honest about it that's not gonna happen unless I break the game by having too many cases would be nice if we could trade cases I think so anyway like closed cases and capsules and stuff like that just trade them around at whatever value they have to buy it's like you're giving a random gift to someone perhaps you will get something crazy pants or you know a, a free play in uh, in the jackpot so that you can cash in items like I want to turn in these 5,000 worth of items must be 10 items or less of course into uh, like a blanco check you can just add it into the jackpot that would be cool no I'm sorry I was too fast there I'm just really excited because now we're getting to the point where the goodies are right right Graven this is where the healing begins good items all over the place no it's not so much the items I'm thinking about but the fact that in just nine cases the upgrade is finally available stop yeah that's okay yeah that's okay I can just look at that that's okay not like adding 20% uh, to our account value or something like that all is forgiven nothing is forgotten so you can add in more so like I said this was what I was waiting for yeah that was um, that was good it does feel special when you unbox good items compared to the jackpot uh, because the frequency of good items is just so much higher on the jackpot so it feels a bit more special when you actually get one in a case earning it the hard way and um, that is what I hope to do with everything in this game um, and that is why this is going to take quite some time but I'm in no rush because I'm having a good time yeah a yabba dabba do time is what I'm having come on now I really like that I had those two knife rare special symbols right next to each other okay so this was a crap one but still yeah I like it I like it a lot very nice crazy difference in 50 cases two knives one being <laughs> Karambit Fade Factory New and uh, one being Junk and in the previous 50 I got I mean okay I did get a Fire Serpent so it was not bad but um, this was a, l a little bit better a little bit better just a little bit but guys we just we need to go in here before doing the upgrades because that was crazy I really like that um, but 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 dum, da, da, dum, dum, dum. so many junk upgrades come on there we have it 500 bucks and we are now legendary eagle masters 
in the campaign with a red power crystal. Yay! Well, we don't have it, but we can buy it. And the Carbo Unlimited. This is where things start to be really, really interesting. Um, so let us see where the Carbo Unlimited is, because that is the ninja stuff. Where are you hiding? Seriously? Combo Unlimited, he said. Did I miss it? There we have it. $300. So, I might as well say this. Next video is going to be $300 farming for the combo. Um, like, absolutely. But I am going to grab the power crystal right away, even though it's small stakes money, but um, bits and bytes. So, yeah. That was really nice. That was really, 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 really nice. So, what is the plan? The plan is grab the combo unlimited, then farm money and then farm cases. So when we have the combo unlimited, I need to farm 750 bucks for the Supreme Master First Class upgrade and 750 bucks for opening 300 cases. So I'm thinking next video is going to be a small build up as in I'm going to buy the combo, get some cases, um, and then we're going to do it pretty much as I've been doing in these two videos. Probably I'll make a single episode where it's all about money uh, so that we can take advantage of the 10x multiplier. And if you guys have seen my click to 10,000 video, you know that takes um, quite some time. Uh, but I mean, Considering that we only need 1500, I don't really need to go like all the way, but I kind of want to. So um, that's the plan. That's the plan. For now, it may change tomorrow. Just saying. So these are the statistics. Our worth of items got a bit of a major jump here. So uh, yay. And um, that was pretty much it from here, guys. Thank you very much for watching.